amended version of the highly controversial interception of communications bill was tabled in Parliament Wednesday by Yamakar MP and State Minister for Legal Affairs Ellsworth Johnson. The bill was tabled under the former Christie administration, but the former government delayed its debate to seek wider consultation after public pushback on the bill. Mr. Speaker, you, you, would, you, would, you, would, you would agree that in the past we had an agency being run without legislation and that was the National Intelligence Unit uh, uh, Agency. And this government has undertaken to abide by the law and by the rule of law. And so in keeping with that, that precept, we brought this bill here today. The interception of communications bill. Mr. Speaker, when I was in another place as our president, I was vociferous in my commentary on the introduction of this bill without first having uh, open, an open and honest public discourse on this bill. And I am happy today that my leader and my party has now presented this bill with some alterations, hoping that at the end of the day, members of the public will have an opportunity to review this bill and assist the government in producing in, in accordance with our constitutional duties, that is to make laws for the good for the good of the Bahamas. 